What's up guys, it's Scooter here Macintosh Tips, and today's video is especially good for music lovers, guys who want to play the guitar, the drums, anything like that. If you love music, this application is going to be definitely for you. It's called Capo. Basically, it's a music editor, and it lets you slow down the beat, or speed up the beat, slow down the pitch, speed up the pitch. Basically, lets you edit the music to where you can slow it down and actually learn how to play the instrument so you can hear every note. Let me go ahead and show you. It's located here in my dock. Now, I contacted the people at Capo, and they were very nice. They sent me... They sent me, uh, I think it was four codes, so I have two codes to give away to you guys today. So congratulations. Their names will be in the description box, so go ahead and look over there. Let me see if you won. So we're going to go ahead and talk about Capo. Now as I open up Capo, it says drag song here. So I've already got this little rift in uh, GarageBand, Magic GarageBand, something simple. Alright, so I've drag that, dragged that over there. You can drag any audio file you have in iTunes. Just go ahead and drag it over. So any song you want, go ahead and do that. So I'll just hit spacebar, and I'll make it plays. Alright, so that's, like, that's a legit song that people might want to play They're, with the guitar. They want to hear every note, see how to play those notes. So, we're going to go ahead and uh, talk about the interface. Now, over here on the left, you see you got the album name and artwork, all that good stuff. And you got the time down below this little uh, blue box. You got the volume of it, obviously. You got the uh, go back to the beginning, and you've got the skip ahead and the play button. And then you know, over here, you have like the condense and separate the notes out a little bit. All right, so basically that's all that is right over here. All right, so now that we got that all set away, now let's go ahead and go back and play it. Now let's say I want to learn how to play this song, and I want to slow it down, because I can't really just hear every note. I just hear a bunch of notes thrown together. Well, over here, I just slag it. Uh, now, over here, you have two options. You have speed, and you have pitch. Speed is basically slowing down the song. Now the guys who made Capo have really, really done a great job because when you slow down the song, it still keeps the quality. It still sounds nice. still sounds good. So let me go ahead and show you. So when speed is selected, it's going to be white. All right? And you got a little scale here. you got a fourth, half, three-fourths. One time is basically the, the uh, original sound speed. And then 1.5 is when it's boosted up. So right now, it's at one, uh, 1, so it's at the original sound speed. I'm going to go ahead and drag it down to about three-fourths or so. All right, let's go ahead and replay it, see how it sounds. So you see it's significantly slower than before, and I'm going to slow it down even more here. So it's a great application, so you can actually just figure out what do you want to learn, what part of the song you want to learn, everything like that. So what part of the song do I want to learn? So let me go ahead and put up at one times again. Go ahead and skip to this part over here, and let me show you this. That's a pretty good part of the song. I want to actually learn how to play that. So I'm going to loop it, all right? I'm going to loop that one part of the song so I can just play over and over until I get it. So I'm going to take my cursor and click inside the white here where my cursor is. I'm going to click right there. I'm not going to click up here, but right here. I'm going to drag it all the way from the start point to the end point. All right, so as you see, the part I want to play is in blue, all right? And the part that I don't want to play is in white. So I'm going to go to hit the play button. <laughs> And so it's just looping back and forth and let me get that. So obviously if I'm a pro at it, I can see if I can play it faster. Alright, but obviously I'm not a pro, so I want to see how slow I can do that. I want to get this down packed. So slow it down. So you can definitely hear the notes there, guys. So basically, uh, let's say, now let's go ahead and mess with the pitch. That was speed. Let's go ahead and mess with pitch. Pitch is when you have the person uh, talking, obviously, mess with their voice. So basically, if I want to open up a new song, just go ahead and drag it in. All right, I'm going to close this one. You can also save your songs so you can always come back to them. Now, if you don't win today, no problem. You can always uh, buy the application. I'll leave the link in the description box. Now, if you're just using the trial, you can use these at five minutes at a time. Now, when your five minutes runs up, you can always just drag it back in there. You can have another five minutes. All right, so moving on, uh, we've got this song here, uh, original beat, original lyrics. I made this a rock man, me and some friends. So uh, let's get to the song here. Let me go ahead and go through the song, get to the part I want to go to. All right, so I'm hearing the part of the song I want to go to, and I want to, uh, I want to go ahead and speed it up. All right. No, it's me. I just joined just like a wreck. I'm with my dogs just like a vet. I could check, so it's never knew that I break next when I come through. Yeah. All right, so as you see, the beat and the, and the pitch, really, it really sounds good. I mean, it doesn't really hinder anything that you got there. So I'm going to go to pitch here. Pitch is selected because it's white. 
I'm gonna move it up a little bit. So moving it up makes it more of a higher pitched voice, all right? So and the plus range. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull that back, and now it's in a higher pitch mouse voice kind of. All right, and I can go even higher than that if I want it to. I can go way high. So if you ever want like a mouse voice or something in your song, go ahead and record it on capo, throw it back in GarageBand, perfect. I can go back down to the left, it'll be in the minuses, it'll be a deeper voice. Alright, so let me go ahead and play that back. Let me go ahead and slow it down. Alright, with a deeper voice and slow down, sounds like this. Makes you sleepy. Alright, but basically that's capo, guys. I mean, it's it's a straightforward application. Uh, I already went over stuff at the bottom. Basically, you can just mess with the speed, mess with the pitch, to where you can actually play the song and learn how to play. It's a great application. Uh, if you're really serious about music, guys, I would consider buying it. And remember, two lucky subscribers have already won Capo, so check for your usernames in the description box. All right, I have already, um, I probably already go ahead and message you uh, with the with the codes or whatnot. And so that's it. This is Scooter Macintosh Tips, guys. Comment, rate. If you were first time watching, go ahead and subscribe. Follow us on Twitter. Do the usual. This is great, guys. Peace.